Okay, so back to my <laughs> last of my period. Hey, uh, in the year 1650, he basically invented the vacuum pump, which is what we have here. Although I'm sure this was not electrically powered. He used the vacuum pump to suck out the air from between two copper <coughs> hemispheres. These copper hemispheres were substantially larger than what I've got there. They're, they're about this big in diameter. So he sucks out the air from the copper, and the air from outside pushes in, just like it did on a can. But the copper was thick enough that the air from the outside wasn't enough to uh, crunch the, the hemispheres like it did to the can over here. As, as it is the metal that is making this up. Okay, so it's not going to crunch it, but it, it is going to push the two together. So he wanted to show off this, this cool invention that he had just done. So he invited the whole town to see this, and he, uh, he got two teams of horses, I think there were 15 horses in each team, to pull on either side of the hemispheres and try to pull them apart. And they couldn't. You know, again, if we have 10,000 newtons or whatever it ends up being, that is a lot of force. And the horses are unable to pull apart. Wow. Well, I'm not going to bring in the <coughs> today, but we will ask for two student volunteers to try to pull this apart um, after I suck the air out. I'll suck out all the air from the inside. We're pretty close to all the air. Uh, I probably can't get all of the air. Yeah. How big were those uh, metal hemispheres that uh, that man used and tried to have the horse pull apart with? It wasn't that same size. It was, was no, they were bigger than this. They were about uh, about this big in diameter, uh, 50 centimeters in diameter. Is how I found them. I looked this up on Wikipedia. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so, no. so now they're going to try to pull these apart and give it a pretty honest try. The dog will try to uh, push itself if they do come apart. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> okay, good. He doesn't have enough friction to give himself leverage. Okay, thanks. So they couldn't get them, wait, wait, don't go in there. They couldn't get them apart. But now I'll just let some of the air back in. Go ahead and, and try to pull, but don't pull it really hard. Because they will come apart now. <laughs> <laughs> there we go, thanks.